There we go. in terms of the weird and wonderful world of sexuality uh, came quite apparent rather quickly that I was more into male attraction than female attraction. Um, I had one or two small relationships to begin with, uh, but the coming out phase is probably the most difficult of all, especially when you've had the background that I've had. Some people probably have it even worse than myself, but when you've had a difficult upbringing in that way, difficult times through school, can't complain about the family, uh, it's very difficult to tell even your most respected confidants uh, about this new development, especially when you've been maybe living a lie for so long before then. Even more difficult, people who might be older perhaps. Uh, but it did happen, and Thank goodness the world's becoming more open to that sort of thing. Let's hope that continues. At least in this country, it is quite a... Uh, it's not really a taboo anymore, which is rather nice to see, uh, especially in some of the cities like Manchester and London and hopefully up here in Edinburgh, where I'm talking to you from right now. Um, I think people need to be liberated in this way and in every other way. You know, no matter what your opinion might be of anything. I think all opinions, no matter how controversial, should be heard. And this is how we make progress. Um, I might go off a bit of a tangent there. But some people don't like homosexuality. Well, that's fine. But what is their reasoning for that? And that's how you get into a dialogue. You get into an argument with these people, you win the argument, because you're likely to, given that over 500 species uh, are exhibit homosexual um, animals of those species uh, that have been recorded. Um, it is quite clearly a natural phenomenon. Uh, and some uh, past human descriptions of uh, uh, theories of uh, how, how they would have been in the past. Indeed, uh, forward-thinking China, as it was back in the 6th and 7th century AD, I believe, uh, condoned it, um, and, and it was quite prevalent. Uh, and many other um, pre-industrial societies uh, but that's me going off on one there. It, it, it's difficult in a world where people do still assume that everyone is straight. It's so difficult to find someone if you are of the LGBT community. Uh, probably even worse if you're trans, I've no experience of that. But it would help a lot more if people were more open, I would say.